Our next Peabody winner is Two Towns of Jasper, a documentary that approaches the murder of James Byrd in an, in an extraordinary manner. Two film crews produced accounts from two different communities, one white, one black. One Town's tragedy reveals a nation's continuing struggle with race. Two Towns of Jasper is about the murder of James Byrd Jr., who in 1998 was chained to the back of a pickup truck in East Texas and dragged uh, for three miles down a country road till his body came apart. The chain was there, the opportunity was there, they just chained him up and started dragging him. It's about a crime that separated communities or made us very conscious of ourselves as black and white. The idea of making it with a white crew that filmed the white community and a black crew that filmed the black community just really seemed like a logical idea. It's a film about a incident that magnifies difference and what people do when they are threatened by difference. You sit there and let someone be dragged to death. There's no person in this world with any kind of humanity to sit there and not do something. Whitney Dow and Marco Williams, the producer-directors of Two Towns of Jasper, will accept the Peabody Award. First of all, uh, I want to thank the Peabody Awards for uh, lunch. <laughs> Marco and I work out of a basement in Lower Manhattan, and this is a lot better than the usual meal we get around midday. It was an extraordinary experience working in the PBS system. Uh, they gave us the, cr the creative freedom to do, uh, to work for, and the time to work for a long period of time to craft the film that we wanted to film. There's a lot of unique organizations that make PBS happen. Um, there is Corporation Public Broadcasting, who is, gave us one of our initial grants that really helped us get the project going. There's ITVS, which is really a unique uh, organization who makes sure that unheard voices get heard on a regular basis and they came up with a lion's share of the funding and put up with all our shenanigans as we tried to finish this film in a three and a half short years. Finally, POV, who was our sponsor on the film, uh, making sure that the film got our message out to the widest possible audience that it could. And the incredible work by Cynthia Lopez and uh, Cara Murtis uh, was really unbelievable to, to see how, how hard they worked to make sure that our voices were heard. I'd also like to recognize Nick Frazier and Netta Hoffman from the TV2 and the BBC, that's flipped actually, but they're who have made sure that our message has gotten out to the world. Anyway, thank you very much. I, I always seem to have to uh, be the one who will make comments about the larger issues, and so I, I was thinking of what Mr. Brokaw said at the start of this afternoon's uh, presentation, and I couldn't help but think about how we are essentially three weeks away from the sixth anniversary of the dragging murder of James Byrd Jr. And less than three weeks away from uh, an event that happened back in Jasper where the gravesite of James Byrd was desecrated. And it makes me think about how important um, it is to address issues of race in our society. Helen, what a privilege and a responsibility I, I feel.